Hello and welcome to part 3 of the Ortho 4XP tutorial series. I recently ran into a problem making ortho tiles for the Faroe Islands, and, naturally decided to share my newfound knowledge with you. This tutorial is for advanced users and I recommend that you start with part 1 if you have not seen it yet. So. Apparently there is a problem with the naming convention, related to the mesh in this area and we have been given options to fix it. My chosen option is to use the HD version 4 mesh from alpilotx.net. I will demonstrate how to extract the required data and also, how to use it to construct the new tile. I will also show you how to use the HD mesh to create the matching overlays. I trust and accept, that you will download and install the HD version 4 mesh, or, that you have already done so. All the details are on the website, and the link is in the description below the video. The next component, that you will need to have, is XP tools. This is provided by Laminar Research and I have also included the link to the download in the description below the video. Once downloaded, you need to find a suitable place to extract the program files. I will use my desktop as a temporary location, for this video. The next step will be to find the correct mesh files. We will start with Ortho 4 XP and take note of the tile ID in the top left corner, as shown. Then, to find these files, you will have to navigate to your X-Plane 11, Custom Scenery folder and then to the HD Mesh folder. Inside the folder you will have to navigate to the folder that contains the DSF files that you need. Please copy and paste them to the XP Tools folder as shown. Something interesting, about these files, are that they are compressed files. Before we can use them we need to uncompress them. The process to do this, starts with renaming them. I use 7-zip as my compression utility, so, I will add a .7z at the end of each file. The next step is, to extract them into the same folder. Next, I will do some housekeeping and move the XP folder to another screen, and also delete the zip files. Once that is completed, we need to start the XGrinder program that is in the XP Tools folder. The XGrinder program will extract the data from the DSF file that we will use in Ortho 4 XP to create the custom elevation mesh for our tile. To accomplish this, we simply drag and drop the files into the XGrinder program window. Three new files will be created for every DSF file that you drag and drop into XGrinder. We are interested in the elevation file. This file will be referenced in our Ortho 4 XP program. You will need to use the blue folder, to open the file explorer and go find and select the elevation file. Next, you have to configure the custom overlay SRC reference folder. Use the blue folder to navigate to, and select the HD global scenery folder. When you have completed the task, you may click on apply and then exit. Please be careful to match the tile to the reference file. Incorrect referencing will result in failure and you will have to try again. Start the process as usual. When you are done, you may put the overlay and tile in your normal library and add it to the scenery file as usual. Repeat the process for each tile, until you are done with the area. 